guys, what is going on? Welcome back to the channel. As always, guys, this is Cody here with Cody Reacts. Wishing you guys a beautiful day as always. And don't forget, guys, hit that subscribe button. It's completely free for you guys to do. So why not, guys? It puts a big old smile on my face. Let's go ahead and talk about it to get into it. I've been doing everyone's reviews. I really appreciate everyone's comments. Pretty soon here, we're going to have an option to go ahead and in the community section, you can go ahead and leave your requests and stuff over there for you guys. It just makes it a lot easier in the comments for me to actually keep track of all the requests. So what I wanted to do, this one actually pertains a lot to me. Um, I, you know, a couple years ago, I started working on project cards and stuff like that. And uh, this song just sounded fitting after my grandfather unfortunately passed away. So this song has a lot of meaning to it. I've never seen the music video, but uh, I've heard a lot of good things and uh, everyone said I should just start doing a reaction video to it. So without further ado, let's get into it, guys. Wiz Khalifa featuring Charlie. See you again, the official video for the Fast and Furious 7 soundtrack, but this is the official video. Let's go ahead and get into it. I'm really excited for it. Let's see what it's about. Are you guys ready? Are right, we good? Those pianos right away, man. It's been a long day without you, my friend. And I'll tell you all about it when I see you again. We've come along. Yo, straight up though, for this video. Charlie was perfect just because we all know his voice is amazing, pitch perfect. It, honestly, this guy's voice is just, it, it's the best chorus you could have for this type of song, I feel like. Away from where we began. Oh, I'll tell you all about it when I see you again. When I see you again. Damn. All the planes we flew, good things we've been through. Then I'll be standing right here talking to you about another path. I know we love to hit the road and laugh, but something told me that it wouldn't last. Had to switch up, look at things different, see the bigger picture. Those were the days. Yo, this is crazy too. I gotta give a shout out to whoever directed this video because I was afraid the video was not gonna have either too much Fast and Furious in it or too much Wiz Khalifa and Charlie in it. But I feel like so far in the first minute, it's the perfect balance. You know, they're going back to some of the best parts that, uh, that you know, one of the last movies he did, unfortunately. And uh, it's just, sorry, I'm burping at the same time. <laughs> no, but it's just, it's great to see, uh, you know, all the connections between Paul and all the castmates. And just in general, see some of the, the best parts of the films over the years. And then on top of that. Wiz Khalifa and Charlie still uh, doing what they do best in this video. So let's keep it going though. Good vibes. It's hard work forever pays. Now I see you in a better place. See you in a better place. Uh, how can we not talk about family when family's all that we got? Everything I would do, you were standing there by my side. And now you gonna be with me for the last ride. It's been a long day without you, my friend. And I'll tell you all about it when I see you again. I see you again. We've come a long way yeah, we came a long way. from where we began. <laughs> you know, we start Yo, and I'll be honest with you guys. Um, you know, after, you know, he passed away, I, I gave up on, you know, building cars and anything like that. I actually, uh, I actually recently, too, I actually um, got rid of all of my uh, vehicles. I just have a basic A to B car. Um, basically just, mm, you know, it's one of those things where it's, it, there comes a time in life where it's like, you know, you just got to put that to rest. It's not a bad thing. Of course, I'm just explaining the reasoning behind it is just, I want it to be something more in life or leave a mark or a name, or even if I make one person smile a day, I feel like I'm doing something better than just building cars and, you know, looking for that adrenaline rush and whatnot. But I don't get that feeling anymore showing off my car to the to the man and the person that I, I see as a hero is no longer here, you know? So there was no point for me and it just saves a lot of money. And on top of that, it lets me focus on YouTube and just in general work and other things that I like to do and enjoy. Definitely, definitely love this part of the video right here when they're all sitting down doing the dinner and St. Grace at the original house. I love this video so far. 
Okay, we gotta stop here because we know we know if you guys watch the movies, we all know Vin Diesel like his Dodgers. So I saw the Dodger Viper, Charger, Challenger, Hellcat, man. It's all it's another but Dodgers so far, but it, it's cool to see him in the video with Wiz Khalif and then also in the actual, you know, if you watch the movies, that's what you always see. He likes his Dodgers, you know, he likes the Challenger, and he's got one of the old school ones, then he goes to the new school, then he goes to the Charger, so He's a Dodge guy, and we all know, you know, of course, uh, Paul, of course, he's a tuner guy. He likes the Skylines and stuff like that, Subarus, WRXs, all that good stuff. So this video is definitely on point to match with the actual movie itself. So love that about this. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. First you both go out your way and the vibe is feeling stronger with small turn to a friendship, a friendship turn to a bond and that bond will never be broken, the love will never get lost. And when brotherhood come first, then the line will never be crossed. Established it on our own when that line had to be drawn and that line is what we reach. So remember me when I'm gone. Uh, that, that's all I that's all I ever say a lot of the times too with everything that I go through. I'm not looking for pity, just, uh, I think it's something MGK kind of said in a thing too. It said, I don't really care how I'm remembered, just let me be remembered. It's kind of like that, except it's like, I do want to be remembered for something, if that makes sense. So whether it's just being a positive person or a, a good influence to kids or a, a just building a platform with a lot of positivity and nothing but kindness. I mean, those are kind of goals to me that I hope to achieve. So the lyrics in this song are just so spot on and Wiz Khalifa did an amazing job writing it, I think. And just in general, I don't think he got enough credit. I know that he got some awards for this song, but I feel like he deserves a lot more credit. He, he really did hit this out the ballpark. It has nothing to do with women, cars, clothes, nothing even to do with smoking weed, which is crazy. But that just goes to show you how great of an artist Wiz Khalifa is. Charlie on the chorus, like I said, amazing. And so far the video, uh, honestly, it's hard for me to say much because, you know, it's close to my heart, but I want to share this with you guys after we hit a thousand. So this is, uh, this is probably my jam here for life. How can we not talk about family with family's all that we got? Everything I would do, you were standing there by my side. And now you're going to be with me for the last ride. Let the light guide you away. And if you guys didn't know real quick, this was the ending of the last movie that he did with him and Vin Diesel driving down the road and then going away. And this song was actually playing at the end of that if you didn't see the movie. So it's really cool to see this all coming together now. Oh, it's been a long day. This, ah, this part. Without you, my friend. And I'll tell you all about it when I see you again. We've come a long way from where we Such a good began. voice, man. Such a good oh, voice. I'll tell you all about it when I see See, and now this is from the last movie, unfortunately, that Paul was alive for. Uh, yeah, and this is the very ending of that, that film. So it's kind of crazy because this same song is playing in the film too so it's kind of cool to see this looks like how it's going to end for the video too just ah pulling out those little heartstrings of mine you know what i'm saying see you again when i see Man, 
Was that was that all of the video I wanted to play? All that? Okay, it seems like it's all. For Paul, that's where we that's what we need to pause it at for Paul, yo. Shout out. Seriously, guys, thank you so much for doing that video with me. I appreciate it. That's one of my own that I've been wanting to do since like I started this channel, but everyone just like requests like 30 videos, but I don't think they understand with a thousand subscribers and probably each person leaving anywhere from five to I've had somebody leave over 25 requests. So I'm at like 3,580 requests. Like when I say I actually mark it down, I do, but you got to understand it might take a couple months for it to be posted because I mean, I still try and do a couple videos a day, anywhere from three to five, depending on my health, but it's just really hard to keep all of that in track. So luckily we're going to have that community section open up here any day now, and then you're going to be able to post over there. Don't worry. I'll make a post just for you guys. I'll pin it to the top and everyone can start. Let me know what artists that they want to listen to or who they would like me to react to next. But guys, thank you so much. I love this song. It's a great song. The music video was so great how it tied in with the movie. Oh my gosh, like I said, and again, because this kind of relates to me and, and, you know, losing another hero in my life, not just Paul, because of course I did have a lot of respect for Paul. I was a huge fan of Paul. I mean, I don't know who wasn't a fan of Paul Walker growing up. I remember going in high school to like the first Fast and Fierce and everyone was like leaving the parking lot just... Everyone was doing burnouts at cops were everywhere. It was just crazy when this first one came out. And then to see so many years later on uh, This Is Furious 7, it's just crazy that seven movies later still going strong and, and a great video and a, again, a great song. Unfortunately, the song was written for, you know, reasons that we don't want to, you know, talk about too much. You know, unfortunately, Paul, if you didn't know, he passed away in a car accident a lot. You know, and this was the last video he was able to shoot. So it's kind of hard watching other like Fast and Furious, any of the new ones coming out. But out of respect, and of course, I did love the franchise and everybody in it. And everybody is considered his family in real life, too. So shout out to Paul. Shout out to Wiz and uh, Charlie for this video. I really do appreciate it. Shout out to you guys for watching and also listening to me babble about my story. But... If you guys even ever wanted to know a little bit more about me, I just shared some of that with you guys. Hope you guys have a beautiful day. As you guys always know, we are off to the next video as always. But like I said, guys, be safe out there. Have fun. Have a beautiful day and a beautiful week ahead. We out. Peace. <laughs>